my name is Mr. Emmanuel. I'll be taking you guys on this topic of approximation. As you all know, if you can recall, if you recall rather, approximation, approximation is actually the rounding off of numbers. In mathematics, of course, you all know that we have 10 digits ranging from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. Now, from these 10 digits, you can form any number you wish to form. For example, if I pick 1 and 0, out of these 10 digits, I'll be able to form what? 10. I can decide to form series of numbers out of these 10 digits, as you all know. Now, but in the world of approximation, all these 10 digits are grouped into two. From 0, 1, 2, 3, and 4. In the world of approximation, like I taught you, is approximated or is represented as 0. Then, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 is being represented as 1. Approximation does not go with the sign just like equal. It has its own sign. Approximation sign Approximation sign is this. There are words that we can use when we are talking about approximation. Words like approximation itself, estimation, rounding off, or round off, correct to. These are words we use in mathematics to represent approximation. We can equally use the word estimate to represent approximation. But today, Words approximate, estimate, round off, correct to, they all mean what? Approximation. You understand? Now, today we'll be talking about rounding off or approximation to the nearest thousand. And we'll probably be talking about rounding off or approximation to the nearest hundred. Now, first, Let's look at approximation to the nearest thousand. I'll cite some examples. So we'll be considering to the nearest thousand. Number one. Round of Please be fast. Round of Now let's look at this. Now, if we are to round off this, now using place value. This one, you know your you know your place value quite alright. Exactly. This one is units, tens, hundred, and then thousand. Because we are rounding off to the nearest thousand, we will approximate the value that is closer to this thousand. That is hundred. And what number is that? Five. Now remember, in the world of approximation, I told you that five is being rounded off to what? One. Now, so we we'll round off this, we we'll approximate this, and that will give me one. That one, I will add it to four. Then, after approximating this value, what next? 
every other digit, including that five, becomes zero. Then you add this one to four. One plus four will give me what? Five. So my final answer, after approximating, is 5,000. I believe it's clear. Now, let's look at to the nearest hundred. value. This one is unit, tens, hundred, and thousand. Because we are rounding off to, we are approximating to the nearest hundred. It is the value that is under tens, which is close to hundred, that we approximate. Go back to the world of approximation. What did I say for would be zero. Now, when you approximate this, it will give you plus zero. Automatically, this value becomes zero, zero. Then you add this zero, not to nine. Please note, to 39. 39 plus 0 will give me what? 39. So this will be what? 9. And then this will be what? 3. I believe it's clear. Alright. Then I'll give you some work to do. Let's do this. You get your assignments after solving this. Thank you very much.